Board Game Bat Cave Episode 7 of Building the Ultimate Gaming Table, Construction of the Tabletop. Uh, the tabletop is large enough that I could not use just two pieces of plywood like some of the other, uh, if you look online at some of the other plans, they just take two four by eight pieces of plywood and they can construct the tabletop out of those. Uh, no luck with this one, uh, the table's too big, so um, I mean that's a good thing, but I had to use three pieces of plywood, which is more expensive, but um, I went with oak uh, cabinet grade plywood, three quarter inch, and uh, this is actually the first big mistake I've made happened while I was doing the tabletop. I had some friends over helping me out, as you'll see in the video, and I got to talking and uh, ignoring my cardinal rule of measure twice and cut once, and I cut on the wrong side of my line on one of the tabletop sections and I had to scrap that piece of plywood so that was expensive um, but it all worked out because now I'm using those scraps from that piece of plywood to do the desktops so uh, you'll see that in upcoming videos so anyway um, still doing it all uh, by hand without power tools except for the sanders we're still sanding with the uh, uh, orbital sander cost me twenty, twenty nine dollars I think, and it's been worth every penny. Um, anyway, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the uh, comment section, and I hope you enjoy it. Uh, we're looking really good on the table, and uh, I hope to have more updates soon. Thanks. Two sections of the table top. We're going to marry them up so that they can not have any gaps in them. Since I hand cut this, they're, you know, it's not a laser straight. So we're going to make them laser straight by marrying them up so that the leaning consistencies in one will be so in the other, and they'll fit together perfectly.
real good, except I'm getting caught up on my post over here, so I'm going to trim that a little bit, move a little closer, and then I'll see what it looks like. Now let's try this again. Still not seamless. Mostly I found that the ends were longer. Someone had worked on the ends most of the time. 